it, to me, um, it is, and I, I'm always careful about saying this because it's a risky thing to say, um, but it is a perfect film. It's a perfect film for a few reasons. It's groundbreaking on its aesthetic. Mm -hmm. From a production design standpoint, mm -hmm. it's groundbreaking in terms of creature design with Giger's work. It's groundbreaking from a score standpoint. It has one freaky ass score. I don't know if you've ever listened to it. It's just as odd as um, Planet of the Apes, the original. Um, it's got that same <laughs> weird yeah. stuff going on. The directing choices in it are beautiful with regards to performance. The dialogue, the overlapping dialogue, um, the casting choice, the style of the characters, the costume design isn't heavy handed. Every corner of every set has been addressed. It's got grit. It feels like you're on a mining ship. Giger to me was the Jesus of creature design mm -hmm. um, because of that movie, but also when you go through his work. How many of you know his work? It's 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 off-putting. It's frightening. Mm. It's gorgeous. It's morbid. It's you know. It's so much in one. I mean, I attempt to do what Giger does in that create something uh, unique, but I certainly couldn't do Giger's work because once you do Giger's style, people look at you as a ripoff, and you would be unless you say, "I'm admittedly doing Giger's style." And there was only one moment I got to do Giger's style, of course, and it was in Prometheus, but. Um, I can only dream of doing a design that's as iconic as what he has done.